Good morning. Um, I'm sitting here in my office. It's a little after 7 o'clock in the morning. I've been up since um, a little after 5. Um, I got a question the other day asking how do I stop myself from binge eating or wanting to binge eat or something like that uh, I don't <laughs> binge eat I haven't on my journey I want to say that I think too much about how far I've come like I, um, you know, I had those two slices of pizza the other day and just after those two slices, I see 280 pounds again. So like when people, you know, when I post things and people say well two slices not gonna hurt you I definitely agree with that it won't it hasn't but my mind my mind won't grasp that so I can't binge eat I guess that's a good thing. Um, sometimes I worry, like, is that a disorder? Um, not necessarily not being able to binge eat, but, you know, worrying about every little thing that I do put in my mouth. Um... I don't feel restricted. I just wish my mind would help me, you know, or remind me to realize that it's okay. I just don't want to be big again. Like, I remember how that felt. I remember how uncomfortable that was. I remember barely being able to fasten the seatbelt on the plane. I remember being scared to sit in the chairs in my son's class, you know, when we had conferences. I remember my boys, my youngest, my six-year-old, saying that his classmates said I'm fat. So maybe that's why I can't binge. Maybe that's why when I eat something that I don't normally allow myself, maybe that's why I immediately, I immediately see 280. I don't know. <clears throat> I've just been thinking about that. I guess that was it. <laughs> you guys, I hope you have a great day. And thank you for um for being there. Because as much as you all say I help you, you really help me too. <laughs> you really do.